12 News is your local election headquarters. Tonight, we continue previewing next week's biggest races in southern New England. In Massachusetts, Democratic U.S. Senator Ed Markey is being challenged for his seat by Republican Kevin O'Connor. 12 News Politics Editor Ted Nisi spoke to both candidates and joins us now with a closer look. After defeating Joe Kennedy in the primary, Ed Markey has one last hurdle to clear if he wants to win another six-year term in the U.S. Senate. We can feel the energy. U.S. Senator Ed Markey found himself in the fight of his career this past year after southeastern Massachusetts Congressman Joe Kennedy challenged him in the Democratic primary. Congressman Kennedy is a progressive in name only. Thank you all. Thanks for being here. Markey defied early predictions of his political demise, beating Kennedy by 10 points. And despite 44 years in Congress, he says he's never felt so fired up. I get up in the morning now more energized than I've ever been before in my life. And it only takes another Donald Trump tweet to supercharge uh, my excitement because everything that we've done over the last generation is on the ballot. On election day, Markey faces Republican nominee Kevin O'Connor, a lawyer and first time candidate. I think that Massachusetts would be well served with a senator who represents new blood, new ideas, a senator who lives in Massachusetts. The pair met for just one televised debate held earlier this month. A new UMass Amherst poll shows O'Connor well behind Markey, but he wants voters to take a second look. And I ask people just to envision the possibility for Massachusetts if we have a strong senator, Senator Warren, in the Democratic caucus, and we have a strong senator and new blood in the Republican caucus, Senator O'Connor. He'll be providing an additional vote to Donald Trump on the floor of the United States Senate. Massachusetts does not want to send another vote for Donald Trump to the Senate floor. Senator Markey's biggest recent legislative proposal, the Green New Deal, has gotten a cool reception from Democratic presidential nominee Joe Biden. Still, Markey says he thinks if Biden wins, a bill to tackle climate change could pass the Senate. Ted Nisi, 12 News. And right now on WPRI.com and our 12 News app, you can learn more about the candidates by watching Ted's full interviews with Ed Markey and Kevin O'Connor.